Click of Engineers before the eye of Settle Palm and Torrents. Repair damage. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wait, they can repair damage atlases? I didn't know that. Um, We're at the Words Memorial, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome, Commander Shepard. And I said I was going to do a ring of everything. See if there's anything that I can see. Now arriving at ward level I hate being stuck here. I hate this guard duty assignment. I hate everything right now. Nothing to do about it. We each stand duty in our own ways. At least your wife and the kids went on that trip you mentioned a while back. Where was it again? They canceled the trip. Donated the funds to some charity when Earth was hit. And then... I'm sorry. Oh, dude. She donated the funds to some Earth charity and then Palavan got hit. Just some of the stories. Completely forgot the train of thought that I was talking about. Let's put James. Wait, Arya's here still? What the fuck? It seems the galaxy can't keep us apart. Since we took back Omega, I've been consolidating my resources for the war. It's a little easier to coordinate from here. So unfortunately, I'll be slumming it on the Citadel for the time being. I hope this isn't a social visit. We still have work to do around here. How's the rebuilding going on Omega? People understand the first order of business is shoring up defenses. No one wants another invasion. So they're enduring valiantly, not that they have a choice. Once again, I am Omega. We'll talk later. I'm sure. Okay. I was curious. That's probably why I couldn't find Omega yesterday. Because she's right here. Omega is uh, not a thing. Or at least not yet. Might be in a little bit. So we got this here. Rapid transit, return to Normandy. Okay. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Uh, sit down, embassies. Like Let's One get that. Moment, now arriving at the so what's at the embassies? Enemies. Tell me you have found my son. Not yet. My apologies. Galaxy wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion. Oof. The council called the invaders Reapers. Don't need that right now. While we're here, we could go to the Spectre. Spectre office. See if there's anything to buy. Bailey, Adina, I doubt they're going to have anything to talk about. Is there anybody here actually? Just Bailey and Adina. Okay. What is, uh, what is Ian? Talk. Absolutely fuck all, actually. 
Um, okay, there's nothing there. Let's just go back to um, let's go back to the Normandy. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Um, no, wait, yeah, no, we did want to go here actually. There's some shops here. Now arriving at Presidium. Have you Common. decided how to tell him? I don't know. A text message is so impersonal. He's off risking his life. He deserves more than that. I could record something, but I hate leaving vid messages. I always get flustered. Maybe you need a script. Or maybe I need to get him on a vid call so I can do it face to face. Who knows when he'll be deployed somewhere with an open comm channel. He knew it'd be hard to communicate when he left you here. Oh, dude. A savage. Come on in, she's great cider, dude. What have we got here? What have we got here? Um, weapon damage ten percent. Exports. We believe that a peaceful heart is a strong heart. Nah. Thank you for shopping at Canala Exports. Don't need any of that. Ultralight pistol materials. If this was ultralight shotgun materials, I'd have took it. If it exists, um, we carry it. Nothing shotgun there though. How you doing, dude? Commander Shepard. General Araka. I think we met in Korra's den. You were pretty miserable, if I recall. Yes. Neck deep in drink just before I retired. I'm clean now. Reinstated. I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now. But he won't sell his top line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help, and I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. Okay, come on in, Smurf Tits. I don't, dude. Oh, it's a fucking bar. Okay. Hey, I remember you. Shepherd, right? Heard you're fighting the Reapers. Matriarch Athena. You were working on Ilium. How'd you end up here? Nah. With the Reapers making noise, I figured it was time to get somewhere safer. So I moved here. I don't think so. I've seen some video footage. Of you looking at Liara. Yeah. Uh. Mm. Matriarch Benazio was, um, was her mother. And, uh, well, she doesn't know it, but I was her father. Wait, what? You mean you were her other mother, right? No, I didn't pop her out. Hell, she never even met me. Sorry, if you were human, you'd both be called the mother. Regardless of which one gave birth. Well, I'm not human, am I? Anthropocentric bag of dicks. <laughs> Liara would love to meet you. Why? To 
doesn't even know me from a hole in the ground. Venezia ran off before the kid was born. Besides, this isn't charity work. She's one of the biggest intel brokers in the galaxy. And she's got some shady connections. Like a human commander that used to work for Cerberus. Sound. I only worked with Cerberus to fight the Reapers. And you're not with him now, I know. If you were, you wouldn't get within a light year of Liara. Is that a threat? I'm no commando, but I've had a thousand years to learn to fight dirty. Nobody messes with my girl. Anyway, you combine her work with Venezia and... Well, the matriarchs might have ordered a hit. I hadn't agreed to keep... That's not gonna happen. No argument here. I only took these crap jobs to keep the matriarchs happy that she's under control. Just as long as we're clear. We're clear. You should come clean with her. It'd be better for everyone. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. Dude, what the fuck? That's a that's a dad. <laughs> oh, we're apparently a bag of dicks. Okay. That bartender over there. The matriarch hired by the Asari government to track my movements. She's your father. I know. I never get to surprise you with anything. I'm a very good information broker. And you haven't talked to her about spying on you? If I did that, they might send someone who wasn't as sympathetic to me. Besides, this is hardly the time for family reunions. See, I kind of want to say this, but... Just making sure you knew. Thank you, Shepard. I appreciate it. Not her choice, is it? As in Shepherds, I mean. I have spoken with many Batarian refugees here, Shepherd. It may interest you to know that they are much more agreeable when the hegemony is no longer watching. Welcome to Casa Fabrication. Sure. Okay. Uh, pistol, assault rifle, sniper, alliance model, Kodiak. Take it. Casa Fabrication Weaponry hasn't forgotten Earth. Neither should you. Welcome to Nosastra Sporting Goods. SMG, pistol, SMG. Good hunting. I really appreciate Look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here, and all my arms are legal, see? These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top end inventory? Shit, you slumming for C-Sec too? I already got harassed by the old Turian with the bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers rip through. So what exactly are you saying? Whatever happens, I figure there'll be survivors, but it'll be chaos. I'm betting things will run on a barter system. So I'm getting a jump. My best stock only trades for hard goods and artifacts with real value. So what gets me access to your top shelf? Heh, <laughs> the Turian just waved credits in my face and spat on it. Nice to see you have flexibility. If you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. Then I'm happy to share my top stock with C-Sec, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. Credits don't talk with me, Commander. C-Sec wants my top of the line. You gotta come through with a couple of artifacts. Interesting, okay. I'm surprised we've not come across any of that yet. Maybe because we've not opened that dialogue yet. So some of the things could be open now, potentially. Um, let's go. Let's go talk to that dude again. Tell him, Commander. Unless you can find a new source of weapons for CSEC, I'm putting together a task force to stop the Blue Suns myself. <laughs> it's a bit extreme. I'll get you your weapons, General. I appreciate the effort, 
But I've spent too much time out of action, Commander. Won't be able to sit on my hands much longer. Yeah, I, I didn't want to do that. What the fuck? I know it was relative to something else. But still. Um... I say sniper rifle. That looks pretty damn good to be honest. Modified to kill Reaper enemies. Um, assault rifle or sniper is just assault and sniper. SMG, chest plate, power damage. Nothing for shotgun. Okay. I've connected with Jonas Sedaris and her cell commander. You can speak with her via that console. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. Who's that spying on me now? Ah, oh, I see. Good. Arya's indentured servant has finally come to deliver me to freedom. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. <laughs> oh, yes. You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. It'd be smart to bury the threats, Sidaris. I'll toss them into the caskets with my victims. I love holding all the cards. Even in here, you must deal with me. I have all the power. Is that right? <laughs> yes. Sane, my second in command, is a weak willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to rot and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. She's a menace. Let me try to make this problem go away. Sounds good. I'll hold the line until I hear from you. Yeah, I'm. I'm probably not gonna do that. So what was? What was? What was that? That was. Um. Uh, speak to Commander Bailey in the Citadel embassies. Find a way to deal with a rocker. Okay. Right, 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 right. Yes, yes, yes. Th th this was sort of why I wanted to go to Omega as well. What if it was slowing and ship use for use the Normandy as a grounds for the summit? Okay, so I guess I have to go to the vid room. So we need to find some artifacts. So I guess we've done this the longer and harder way. So we need to appear. Nothing over there. Nothing's going to reach the citadel. We need to turn back to our military position. Nobody wants to see things. I've been over there. Okay. Um. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. Is there anything in the in the Holden area? Areas tagged of Let's go and have a look anyway. You never know. There might be something. I think there is a vendor or something here somewhere. I think. Welcome to 
to Batarian State Arms. Assault Rifle Piercing Mod, Assault Rifle Omniblade. Yeah, we gave um, something religious to him, didn't we? Something about the Batarian faith. CSEC. Tell him Garrus Vakarian would consider it a personal favor if he could reallocate the shipment so these people don't starve. Men, get ready for trouble. Oh dear. Not here for that, Zane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris' release. Oh, you're the one coordinating that, right? My idea, you know. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. Saying you should run Eclipse. Huh? You can do it. Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. Right. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. Good man. Well, that was easy. Okay, nothing though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're just gonna keep looping that until I do the rest of the summit thing, right? Okay, so there, there is, there is nothing else. I think we already dealt with them. Say that again. Thanks for your help, Shepard. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Um, let's go to Bailey. It says we needed to go to him. <clears throat> excuse me. It says we needed to go to him anyway. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. How are you doing anyway, Cheese Grease? I'm sorry, dude. How are you doing, man? Good morning, Twisted. How are you doing? What are you guys up to today? It never rains, but it pours, eh, Shepard? That bad, huh? Things here are getting tense. So many refugees scuttling about. Rumors flying about the war. People are walking around eyeballing each other and we can't keep up with the reports on suspicious behavior. It'll probably Hold get on. worse before it gets better, Bailey. Yeah, if it ever gets better. Hold on. They said we needed to come to Bailey, right? Huh, it might have been that, that call we had. Just interesting. Yeah, we're going to have these two here in our quest log and we're not going to be able to do them. I hope that at some point we can. You right, you're bored, but you don't know what to do. One of them days, you know, where you load up something lasts five minutes. Turn it off because you're not in the mood. Ah, uh, yes, go to. Go to the Normandy. Now arriving at Docking Bay D24. Um. So hopefully now we can unlock some other stuff, artifacts and whatnot. Uh, meet with the diplomats. That's really the oh, find find artifacts. Never mind. I thought 
I thought it would have been kind of like a discovery thing. How much fuel do we have? A thousand? Oh, cool. Nice. Voila. Signal confirmed. Oh, Jesus. All right. Um... Let's leave out the orbit. Nope, it's... Oh, we gotta recover them. Okay. Uh, let's leave the orbit, actually. It says the Reapers will fuck off if we do a mission, so let's... Pop that down. Let's pop another one here. I hope they will fuck off when I do the mission. Oh, dude, it might not be a mission. <laughs> I didn't think of that until I did it. Black market artifacts, it's not a mission. Roll, roll. No, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Reapers eluded. 50%, there's something else in there. Fuel? Fuel. 100%. Perfect. Faster than light jump successful. <sighs> Boop. I'm not going to go back to the Citadel just yet. Should we just do the Reapers and kind of progress the story a little bit? Not the Reapers, the difference. That way, um, some of the systems might unlock. Yeah, I know this, but I want to scan it anyway, just in case. You never know. That nah, fuck all. Okay. The diplomatic ships of the Salarians, Turians, and Krogan float far away from one another out of weapon range. Messages sent by each faction indicate they would welcome the Normandy as a neutral meeting ground for their diplomats. The fact that they have not agreed on a ship to serve as a neutral meeting point before now does not bode well for the negotiations. Commander, the Salarian Dalatras and Krogan clan chief are ready to come aboard. Have them brought to the conference room. And hope this doesn't start another war. The Krogan is in no position to make demands. The Krogan has a name. Erd not Rex. And I'm not just some junkyard Varen you unleash whenever you're in trouble. I've got my own problems. Reaper scouts have arrived on Tuchunka. So why should I care if a few Turians go extinct? Trying to draw out negotiations will get you nowhere, Rex. I have no time for it. Just tell us what you want. I'll tell you what I need. A cure. For the genophage. Absolutely not. The genophage is non-negotiable. Why are you so opposed to the idea, Dalatras? Because my people uplifted the Krogan. We know them best. You mean you used us to fight a war you couldn't win? It wasn't the Salarians or the Asari or even the Turians that stopped the Rachni. It was Krogan blood that turned the tide. And after that, you ceased to be useful. The genophage was the only way to keep your urges in check. <laughs> He's got a fucking urge right now. not like him, but Rex is right. Insulting him won't change that. I won't apologize for speaking the truth. We uplifted the Krogan to do one thing, wage war. It's all they know because it's all we wanted them to know. Your people should have thought the matter through then. Was it really a surprise the Krogan revolted? 
That's precisely my point, Commander. We made a rash decision. We turned to the Krogan in desperation. It's the same mistake you're about to make today. No good can come from curing the genophage. Whether you like it or not, we need Krogan help to win this war. And what happens when the war is over? We'll find a new way to keep the peace. And they'll break it. Enough. This is all theoretical. It would take years to formulate a cure. There's no time. My information says otherwise. A Solarian scientist, Malin, grew a conscience. He was on my planet, testing a cure on our females. I remember. His methods were barbaric. But what you didn't know is that other females survived his experiments. So the Dalatress here sent in a team to clean up the whole mess and to take them prisoner. Where did you get this? It, it could be a fabrication. Don't insult me. Those are my people. They're immune to the genophage, and you're going to give them back. Dalatras, is this true? How will curing the genophage benefit my people? How long do you think you'll last alone against the Reapers? Because if you don't help, that's how it'll end up. And I'll be the last friendly Turian you ever see. What's it gonna be? The females are being kept at one of our STG bases on Sirkash. But I warn you, Commander, the consequences of this will be... ...will be nothing compared to what happens if the Reapers win. Let's get the females. You're not setting foot on Sirkesh. This will take time. It happens now. As a Council Spectre, Shepard can oversee the exchange. We're going. I won't forget this, Commander. A bully has few friends when he needs them most. He's, he seems so blinded that... I, I can see his point to a degree. Like, after the Reapers, the Krogan are probably gonna have a bitch fit and, you know, start war on everything. So I see, I see his point, or her point. But they're so blinded to right now. I can't see what's directly in front of their face, that kind of thing. Um, so we don't we don't get Rex, which is feels bad, man. But we do get Edie and Liara. So let's take them. Wow, I'm so happy I saw Rex. What the fuck? Four points. Three, three. Okay, yeah, we've got nothing. We can't do anything. Well, we could, but it'll be useless. I kind of prefer to power up the stuff that I've already got rather than spread my points out. This is the Solarian homeworld we're headed to. They aren't used to seeing Krogan here, so let's keep it simple. We land, get the females, and leave before anyone changes their mind. I still don't trust a word they say. Let diplomacy play out, Rex. You'll get what you want. Just like you're getting what you want, Shepard. What are you talking about? I found out you had access to Malin's data and destroyed it. That's not fair, Rex. Shepard's here for you now. Is she? These females are my people's best and last hope of curing the genophage. Whose side are you on, Shepard? Destroying the data was a mistake. This war has shown me every species has a right to thrive. I want to believe that. We'll see how things shake out. Commander, I have the Solarian base on sensors. Set her down. Yeah, man, I don't we'll want to piss off... this out later. I don't want to piss off Rex. Rex is fucking awesome. He's got understandable grudges. Commander, Solarian ground control says we don't have clearance to land. Tell them the Dalatras authorized this herself. 
I knew they'd never keep their word. Let's see them try to stop a Krogan airdrop. Rex? No! We have an unauthorized landing. And who authorized you to hold my race hostage? Wait, is fucking biotic now? Something worth dying for. This matter can be resolved, but I must insist you remain under guard. <clears throat> I can handle this, Rex. If anything goes wrong, and all bets are off. <laughs> I've had a quick, and I appreciate your understanding, Commander. With war on everyone's minds, our people are on edge. <gasps> Careful! Watch the containment shield! I'd hope to never see one of those again. As you can see, this base contains sensitive information. What kind of work goes on here? Evolutionary trials, morphological simulations, exogenetic assessments. Nothing is ever simple with Solarians, is it? Science has always been our best defense. The research we do here has kept Sirkesh safe for millennia. Does that include studying lost Krogan? The females were in poor health when we found them on Tachanka. They were brought here to stabilize their condition. This whole planet smells wrong. I'd like to see them. Of course. I'll need to clear you for the lower levels. Give me a few moments and meet me near the elevator. Attention biolabs. Please prepare for yard specimen arrival. Dude. This but yeah, Rex. Solarians come from, huh? No wonder you're so soft. Too busy writing poetry about waterfalls. I mean, us, us Earthlings do as well, dude. Shepard, I don't like this. I should be the one going in. You might not like me much, Rex, but you're gonna have to trust me here. What I'll do is give you a chance to prove your apology meant something. I considered you a friend, Shepard. I'd like to get back to that. Fair enough. Yeah, me too, actually. Me too. Who tipped you off about the females here? Sorry, Shepard, but they're listening to every word we say. I prefer my Salarian liver served raw. <laughs> Besides, you'd think this is the kind of thing the Shadow Broker would have known about. Too bad I don't know him. Or her. I'm sure the Broker was very busy. Back on the Normandy, you said Reapers were sighted on Tachanka. Clans Jorgal and Ravenor sighted a few landing parties. The Reapers are up to something. Tuchunka may be a pile of radioactive rubble, but it's our pile. And we'll fight the last Krogan to keep it that way. What do you know about these females? They weren't fertile, so we used them as decoys to draw off enemies from the ones who were. But Malin's experiments changed that. These damn piejacks stole them right out from under us. That's a pretty brutal way to treat your women, Rex. The females suggested it. We've had to make a lot of tough choices to ensure we don't all die off. A harsh but necessary decision. It's just one more thing that'll get better when the genophage is cured. Are the Krogan ready to fight the Reapers? Ever since Sovereign showed up, I figured this day would come. My people have spent too much time selling ourselves out as mercenaries. Now we can get back to doing what Krogan do best, saving everyone else from giant monsters. Krogan do enjoy reminding us about the Rachni Wars, don't they? And Asari never let us forget they're better looking. <laughs> <It's good. laughs> I'll be going now. Yeah, let's get on with it. Proper identification should be maintained at all times. 
That's kind of true, actually. I didn't expect that one. Please don't touch that. As I said, Commander, don't touch that. Again, I would ask you to refrain from touching that. Perhaps don't touch that means something different in your language. I would rather not refer this matter to the human embassy. Touch it all you want. You'll never find out what it does. Are humans really so deprived of stimulus that they must insist on touching everything? I'm afraid if you keep touching that, you risk a diplomatic incident. Further manipulation of that object is grounds for further admonishment. Really? You must stop touching that. Once more, the Salarian Union formally requests that you not touch that. Fine, if you are so enamored of that object, then I suggest you get your own feces analyzer. We've already been down there. No more. <laughs> Fucking amazing. Oh, okay. A cyber analyst over in Intel told me the Turians can't hold out much longer. He's hearing the Reapers have them against the wall. The Turians have the biggest fleet in the galaxy. And we're only a few mass effect relays away from the whole mess. Oof. Commander Shepard, it's Major Kirahi. I'd heard you were coming. Fucking Kira He. I remember, yeah. Good to see you again. Sounds like you've been promoted. Yes, due in no small part to our mission on Vermeer. Hold the line. You saved my men that day. It's nice to see you, Major. Same to you, Dr. Tassoni. It seems the Reapers have a way of bringing us together. How'd you get posted to this base, Major? I led the team on Tachanka that found the females. Nasty business. Malin may have meant well, but his operation was crude. Test subjects were unaccounted for. The females easily escaped the lab. What do you think about bringing the female Krogan here? Our scientists say it's important to preserve the females. Evolutionary paradigms. I say when people know you're hiding something valuable, they'll want to steal it. Either way, I have my orders. They'll be your problem soon enough. I guess we're both still feeling the effects of Vermeer. Yes, ironic. You destroyed the genophage cure, yet now it's the key to an alliance. Your standoff with Erdnot Rex is legend within STG. I'm sure you saw Rex's entrance. Our colony's three systems away saw it. He isn't pleased with the security arrangements. Apologies, but better that than a Krogan with a shotgun wandering the base. Think of all the casualties. Our med pay couldn't handle it. Security seems high. You expecting trouble? Our motto in STG is to always expect trouble. Failing that, create trouble for someone else. Our enemies have the same idea. A devious yet practical approach, common among Salarians. Are the Salarians prepared for war with the Reapers? I've heard what they're doing to your Earth. I'm not sure any species can prepare for that. Though, rumors suggest you're building a superweapon of some kind. This business with the females is part of it. I need the Turian's support, and they need the Krogan's. Which is why I never became a diplomat. Too much hand-holding. Leave it to the Dalatress. Nice seeing you again, Major. Likewise. And, Commander, regardless of what the politicians decide, you can count on my support retaking Earth. You'd do that. Consider it my way of returning a favor. It would be an honor to fight alongside you again. Good day. Kira, he's a legend. Agree with him or not, our orders are clear. Ensure the smooth handover. This is a restricted area. Please stay back. Who gave the order? Our superiors. That's all. Okay. So we're going to go... This is Senior Research Director Wicks, authorizing visitor access to lower level. Now take this elevator down and someone will... What's happening? Sensors have picked up activity on the perimeter. Hurry, Commander. Someone will meet you below.
Get right here, you better be safe. All specimens are accounted for, sir. Shepard, excellent timing. Good to have you here. Morden? Eyesight's still sharp. Surprise, understandable. Hadn't expected to return to work. You're back with STG? Special consultant. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. Helped female Progan. Fed information to Clan Erdnot. Encouraged political pressure to free female. You must be Rex's inside source. Yes, can explain later. Security warning's not normal. Need to get off world for sake of Krogan. Females had weakened immune systems. Side effect of Malin's cure. These didn't survive. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking perfect time. <laughs> A mighty miracle. Thank you for the 45 bits, dude. <laughs> Is it because we destroyed Malin's research? Unlikely. Cellular degeneration in progress when females discovered. Couldn't help them. I'm sure you did everything you could, Morton. Arrived too late. Cannot delay now. One survivor, immune to genophage, can synthesize cure from her tissue. She's still here. Yes, last hope for Krogan. If she dies, genophage cure... Problematic. Please be careful. Krogan slow to trust. I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Are you here to kill me? Goddess, what she's been through. Erdnot Rex and I are here to take you home. Why? What am I to you? Have the Salarians been mistreating you? Those are my sisters you saw back there. They died in a lot of pain. Did the best we could. And now I know I'm the only one left. That makes me dangerous to a lot of people. What about you, Commander Shepard? Why are you here? I really, I really love this game. It's plural. You're the future of the Krogan race. I'm fighting for that. Give me an update. Outbound communications have been severed. We're cut off. Secure all data to off-site location. What's happening? We have multiple ships inbound. Only one survived, Rex. It might be safer down here. What? So the Solarians can kill her like the others? No deal. If you still want this alliance, get her out of there. Release the female. We're leaving. I can't. Protocol states during lockdown, no specimens. <laughs> Objection noted. Now, please release Krogan. <laughs> Need to monitor pod as it clears quarantine procedures. Meet us at next checkpoint, Shepard. Likely Cerberus opposes Genophage cure. You'll see Tachanka again, I promise. Get to elevator, Shepard. Uh, Manny Miracle, thank you for the follow, dude. And the 45 bits, you're a legend. Thank you so much. Yeah, I fucking love these, these games. Watch us secure. Yog. Yeah, yeah. Um, let us let us see if there's any loot. Log, morning Solus, one six two point three. Used SDG ties to secure station here. Gained autonomy in caring for Krogan test subjects. Females were obviously dying. Barbaric experiments. Malin's fault. My responsibility to fix. Need to save them. No more. No more dead. This is why we like Morden. Something's wrong with the elevator. It's not responding. There. Try it now, Commander. Um, oh, give me one moment, dude. One moment. Looks like there's no other loot. Try the elevator, Commander. 
Yep, come boss. Oh, Jesus. Well, that went well. Is there another way out of here? Oh, coming, boss. Shepard, it's Rex. I took the shuttle. Do whatever it takes to get the female up to the landing pad. I'll try to make life miserable for Cerberus. <sighs> yeah, you do that, dude. Taking enemy fire, but jump back four. They're about to get nuked, aren't they? Yeah, I'm sure there will be. Is he... Yeah, they got nuked. That went nowhere. He went somewhere. Love this shotgun, so good. Oh, I go. I did. I picked up the ammo on the way. We're on our way. Give me a set more then. It doesn't look. Is that the yog? They've never had to fight a yog face to face. We did. Ah, Jesus. Careful. There goes the next shadow broker. <laughs> yeah. Not funny. <laughs> Oh, what was that? Shotgun something? Spare ammo. Okay. Hot integrity. Hot boss. I can't see shit. What the fuck? Hello? Oh. Fucking smoke is hate them. Oh, bye. Data pad, I'll take it. Oh, 
What the fuck? What the fuck? That went through him. Hello? Oh, okay, we got it. Are you okay? Wait, we gotta do that again. Oh, no, we don't, no, we don't. Oh, don't feel bad for that guy. All hostiles are down. Let's give it a cheeky quick save, just in case. Well They're capable of anything. What do they want, though? Oh, Kiri. Commander, stay back. Hostiles just down the hall. Is there an easier way around? You could say that. Go, Commander! I'll cover you! Arise, squad. Your orders are to hold position and block access to next checkpoint. God, Jesus. You think? Taking them head on may not be the best idea. Now, whoever said that. <laughs> Is there anything else here? Cool. Uh, let's have a look, see if there's anything around. Yeah, like this. I'll take the ammo there as well. Oh, forgot of a gun. Dr. Solis's theory is likely true. Cerberus was informed of the Krogan's presence. Their response time is too rapid. Every war has its traitors. Wait. He seems fine, but there's no... Is there anybody else? I can't see... Oh! Sentry interface. Take it. <laughs> Nothing else here. That with the ladder from downstairs. Fire. Oh, there's a pot integrity. Okay.
Wait, what? <laughs> okay. Fuck. <sighs> Damn it. Do you want to talk? The response time is too rapid. Every war has an I'm headed up top! Mistake, my mistake, my mistake, my mistake. Oof. That was sketchy. I forgot they were there. So there was that thing, and there was another thing, wasn't there? I'm doing pretty damn good, thank you. How are you doing? I don't think there was anything else. Yep, there was nothing. Um, let's give it a cheeky quick save, just so we don't have to do that again. You're right, working working day especially now is Oh oh wow sorry it took me took me two times to read that. Holy shit. Let's not walk our ass into that this time, shall we? Yup, yup. One moment. Could be things around. Pistol scope. Look around. There must be a power conduit nearby. M13 Raptor. Looks like a sniper rifle. It is. It is. <laughs> nah, it's okay. It's okay. Scorpion. I think that's the pistol that he was using. Hang in there. How many more checkpoints? 
Just the landing area. Hope heard not Rex still waiting. Rex can't keep his hands off a fertile female. He'll be there. I'll see you up top. Take him out. We found the Krogus. Don't feel bad for that guy. What? That was the last one. Let's get the hell out of here. Yes, let's. I, I, I didn't think it was going to be a talkie research terminal. Terminal. Um, we got to go up, right? Where the tits do we go? Wait, back through this way? Dead others, yes. Let's give it a let's give it a cheeky quick save, just in case. Again, the commission done. Please authorize final release. Can't leave otherwise. Yes, yes, yes. Ammo. We waited too long. Sever us back. No, no, no. Oh, dude. Wait, what? Shepard, you must authorize release. Pod then transfers to loading area. Let's get you out of there. Take this thing easy. Shepard, I can't land until you deal with that thing. It's too dangerous. Kogan has been acquired. Door is damaged. Can't get out. Stay clear. I've got this. Protect the Krogan, Shepard. She's vulnerable. On it, boss. Cerberus never did play fair. Oof. That was a that was a cheeky one. Shepard, I think you did it. Looks clear from here. I'm coming in now. Nice. 
Where are you coming from, dude? Wait, what happened to Cortez? Commander, I'm hearing chatter you're brokering a treaty between the Krogan and the Turians. If I get Krogan boots on Palavin, the Turians promise me their support. And how does Cerberus get involved? I don't know. The elusive man is up to something. Then keep them at bay. I can't overstate what a victory this treaty would be for the Alliance. We'll need all the help we can get. How's the Prothean device coming? Alliance R&D has officially begun construction. The team has dubbed it Project Crucible. We're throwing everybody who knows how to hold a hammer at it. This is going to be the most ambitious undertaking in human history. Will we get it done? I'm not saying it won't be a challenge, but our researchers tell me the designs are elegant, massive in scope, but strangely simple as well. We can do this, Shepard. You can do this. Never doubt that. No, sir. Good. Hack it out. You have the female, Rex. A cure for the rest of your people can come later. That wasn't the deal. But Palavin needs your reinforcements now. We can't delay. Unless every Krogan gets the cure, there's no alliance. Morden, how long will it take to finish a cure? Need to synthesize base antigen from female. Also requires healthy male Krogan tissue. We'll need a sample. You're looking at it. Acceptable. We'll need you to remain aboard Normandy for a procedure. Uh, let's hope the food's gotten better. Formulating a cure that works for every Krogan sounds like a tall order, Morton. Can you do it? Of course. Similar to Genophage Modification Project. Working against own alterations this time. Not as simple as garbage DNA blocking attachment sites. We'll need to counteract shutdown of redundant nervous system, adjust neurotransmitter levels. Got it. We'll create cure, Shepard. Don't need to worry. Then get started, Morton, and make it quick. Always do. We'll be in Medbay if you'd like to speak more. Eve requires tests. Eve? Female's real name unknown. Normandy, a human vessel. Human mythology seemed appropriate under circumstances. Suggest so speaking with her. New perspective. Surprising in Krogan. Now, is there anything else? 
There's a small matter concerning a ship we've lost contact with. What happened? I'd rather discuss it... in private. Turian problems can't even come close to what I've got. What is it? Some of my men went missing. The rest of it we can discuss... somewhere else. I'll find you both in the war room. Just be ready to talk. <laughs> One is for up. Alright. What do we got? We can almost do the shit. Almost. Commander. You said one of your ships had gone missing. Crashed, actually. I couldn't speak in front of the Krogan. Our ship went down on Tuchanka. Now they're pinned by an advanced guard of Reapers scouting the planet. What are your men doing there? I'm sorry. That's classified. But it's vital they be rescued. They must complete their original mission. It's a matter of... galactic peace. I'll do what I can. I appreciate your help. And understanding. I understand this is a difficult time for you, Primarch. But Earth can't survive without reinforcements. Can I still count on your help? If the Krogan help us on Palavan, then I give you my word. How is it being the Primarch? Not what I imagined. The battle of all time is happening on Palavan, and I'm light years away, reading casualty reports in the millions. If I'm going to die, I want to be with my men, so there's no doubt we fought to the last soul. I understand. Leaving Earth to save it, it's one of the hardest things I've ever done. I'm not surprised. Garrus speaks highly of you. You never asked to be a leader, yet your people will die if you refuse. We find ourselves in similar circumstances. Let's hope the spirits grant us the strength to see it through. How are things on Palavan? The casualty reports are staggering. The Reapers are using our own tactics against us. Destroy the enemy with overwhelming force. I've seen the same on Earth. The strategist in me admires their brutality. The Turian in me knows I'm watching the destruction of 15,000 years of civilization. My civilization. The Krogan will make sure that doesn't happen. Assuming you're successful with the cure. We will be. You have to be, Commander. I don't want to go down as history's last Primarch. The Solarian Dalatras worries about what the Krogan will do once they're cured. How do you feel? It won't matter if we don't stop the Reapers, but I understand her doubts. The moon you found me on? That's where we made our last stand against the Krogan during the rebellions. They were that relentless. How did it turn out? The Krogan started using asteroids as weapons, directing them against our colonies. We had no choice. The genophage was our last resort. So yes, Krogan intentions after this war will be a serious concern, but I'd rather have a grateful ally than a resentful enemy. Reaching out to the Krogan for help must be difficult for you. We can't allow the mistakes of our past to cloud the future. Your race and mine were once enemies. The first contact war, as you call it. I was there. Dodging shells fired by your navy. But look at us now. Standing in a ship of Turian human design. Working together. Your men that crashed on Tachanka. How many are there? A platoon. You said their mission was a matter of galactic peace. Why? I'm sorry, Commander. As I said, it's highly classified. Look, if you want me to put my ass on the line, I need answers. I can't tell you. Please understand. The commander is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus. He'll be your contact. Victus? My son. I needed someone I could trust completely. That's all. Of course, Commander. He's gotta go meet his son. Interesting. Okay.
Um, let's go talk to Rex. See what Down he has. For cash. That was the old shepherd I remember. You laid it on the line for us. I guess you do still care about Krogan. Are we good? The genophage isn't cured yet, but I'm losing the urge to throw you out the airlock. You said one of your squads is missing. They were scouting out the Rachni relay. We've heard rumors of trouble in the area. Rachni? Thought that might get your attention. I have a favor to ask. It's big. Don't tell me they're back. All I know for sure is our scouts went silent as soon as they arrived. I've got Arlac Company, my best unit, on standby. You give the word, and they'll meet you there. I'll see what I can do. Get on it, Shepard. What will you do after the genophage is cured? Once we deal with the Reapers, most Krogan will want to settle a score with the Turians and Salarians. I won't let them. That isn't our path forward. This time will be different. A lot of people will be relieved to hear that. No one wants to repeat history. They know we'd probably win this time. But war has never brought us anything except misery. It's time to focus on rebuilding. Which, if you'd ask, I could have told you before you destroyed Malin's research, Shepard. What's the situation back on Tachanka? I'm still getting scattered reports of Reaper forces arriving. Something big is brewing. I won't let those things take Tuchanka. Not when we're about to cure the genophage. My people have had enough bad luck in our time. Back on Sir Kesh, it looked like the female Krogan could hold her own. Our females don't lack for spirit. For males, a good show of force sorts things out. But females like to talk about it. Then think about it. Then talk about it some more. No offense. Believe it or not, we sometimes have good ideas, Rex. You should try listening. Yeah, but our women have so many of them. So sometimes I pretend to listen and... Well, let's just say Krogan females have <laughs> tempers too. How could there be trouble with the Rachni? They were all but extinct. The last queen promised to disappear forever or be destroyed. I know, I was there. I've got a bad feeling about this. It may not be Rachni, but maybe it is. Could be another invasion. If they're crawling out from under some rock, you know how bad it could get. We need to stop them. That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Anytime. And Shepard, I like what you've done with the Normandy. Got tired of always hanging around the cargo bay before. I still don't have a window like Liara does, but it's progress. Wish I could knock some heads around with you, but duty calls. If the Solarian says my DNA is important, who am I to argue? Oof. Oh, oh yeah, this is the uh, thing. Okay, so. Oh shit! Twelve and a half grand. Do you think the Solarians would have a base on their homeworld secured better? Nah, they were solid. Cerberus has Reaper tech. Compared to those upgrades, the Solarians might as well have been throwing rocks. Commander, we've got new reports of Cerberus activity on Tachanka. I've marked it on the galaxy map. Thanks. Is there any emails? Info for you from Ferran. It's been a while. I'm glad to hear you made it off Earth and that Liara's with you. Getting off her old shit was the best thing we could have done. Oh, Ferran. Yeah, of course. Can't tell you how sick I was of that cabin and tripping over the drone. Don't even know how it kept finding me in a ship that big, even after I turned off its tracking. I've got some interesting information for you. Talk with Glyph to sort out the data. Hope it helps. Hold in the line. <laughs> God damn it, Gary. <laughs> It was a pleasure seeing you again on Sakesh. Even if the circumstances were less than ideal, it seems fate has decided our meetings coincide with galactic threats. So be it. To that end, I wanted... So if if you think about it, going from Mass Effect 1 to 3, the kind of how it escalates is pretty damn cool. I like that. Um, STG will be there to help when you need arises, regardless of the political climate. 
You were there for us in our hour of need. We look forward to return the favor. Oh, Jesus. Um, Thessia Asari scientist Vrana Thanoptis has died in custody, allegedly committing suicide after she was arrested for the murder of multiple Asari military officials. Prior to her death, investigators said Thanoptis spoke of voices in her head, which they believed to be indicative of her indoctr indoctrination. The voices foretold the ascension of the Asari and told Thanoptis that anyone find the Reapers needed to die. Noptist worked on a top secret project for former Spectre Saren several years ago. Really? Okay. She likely became indoctrinated. She received a pardon from the Asari government in exchange for providing research assistance on the Reaper technology. The Noptis was believed responsible for planting a makeshift explosive device that detonated at a research center, killing five visiting Asari military officials along with four civilians. Attack seriously wounded a dozen more and caused significant damage to the facility. Wait, and what's this got to do with us? I mean, nice little knowledge drop there, with um, Thanopsis being Saren's uh, kind of bitch buddy. But what's that got to do with us? And good morning, Vivi. Here doing the lurk. Thank you for it. I appreciate it. Mr. Kesh certainly offered me a new experience. What do you mean? Normally I'm not one to fly co-pilot, but when an 800-pound Krogan requests to take control of your shuttle, you comply. Probably wise. I did say, where's Cortez? Uh, Rana was the one on Vermeo let you escape, and also in Mass Effect 2. Is it bad that I actually don't remember that? Like the name. What's going on? I'll talk to you later. Adios. Okay. Have all as well. You're actually ill for once. Hope everything's okay. There's loads I don't remember. <laughs> Most of the game from the last time I played it. Hey, it's just an opinion piece. If you don't like it, don't download it. You're saying we don't need Terra Nova. Lose one colony, save five. That's the math. You know what the commander did for us? The colony? Yes. I was on a little thing called the news. You think you can fly on this ship, sit next to us at chow time, and then broadcast something like that? That's traitorous. Hey, it's just an opinion piece. If you don't like it, don't download it. You're saying we don't need Terra Nova. Lose one colony, save five. That's the math. You know what the commander did for us? Wait, colony? what? Yes. I was on a little thing called the news. You think you can fly on this ship? Sit support Ensign Copeland or support Diana Allies? Like that? That's traitorous. I don't hey, know what's going on. It's just an opinion piece. You Obviously don't like they're arguing it, don't about... It. Um, You're saying we don't need Terra Nova. Lose one colony, save five. That's the math. You know what the commander did for us? The colony? Yes. I was on a little thing called the news. You think you can fly on this ship, sit next to us at chow time, and then broadcast something like that? That's true. I mean, I'd like to see the broadcast. Hey, it's just an opinion piece. If you don't like it, don't download it. You're saying we don't need Terra Nova. Lose one colony, save five. That's the math. You know what the commander did for us? The colony? Yes. I mean... A little thing called the news. You think you can fly on this ship, sit next to us at chow time, and then broadcast something like that? That's traitorous. Hey, it's just an opinion piece. Fuck you it. Don't like Stand down, yeoman. She is allowed to voice her opinion until I disallow it. <laughs> aye, aye, commander. But... How does she get to say whatever she wants to the whole galaxy and there's no other side? I'll be clear that the opinion expressed is just my own. Well, okay. It's not great, but okay. Does it really matter who I sided with then? 
You know, in the old days, they didn't have automatic cameras. Reporters had to cake on the makeup. Do we need to talk, Commander? Get off my ship? No, we're good. We're good. Not right now, Allers. Let me know when we do. Okay, I didn't know there was going to be anything other than get the fuck off my ship. <laughs> No way is any human that reasonable. <sighs> yeah, I know, right? Oh. Model Shadow Broker. I mean, I'd like to say, I'd, I'd, I'd like to consider myself so, Gabby, reasonable. Have you seen Edie's new body? Oh, I knew this was coming. I just mean. It's an amazing work of engineering. Elastic titanium silicon polymers, ultra light harmonic phased power cells. Mm -hmm. And if she ever accidentally walks into a wall, there's just so much padding. Ugh, I knew it. Wish I were a wall. You pretty much are, Kenneth. <laughs> Those FBA couplings you got last tour are still holding up. Thanks again, Commander. All good, Commander. Okay. Uh, by that you mean passionate about something one second and then empathetic the next. I, I know what you meant. I know what you meant. Um, oh, we've already been here. I thought I was on the other side. I mean, I guess it depends on what you're arguing. Why are you so interested in my people, Asari? Earthians are always an enigma, a mystery to solve. I wanted to know what happened to your civilization. Why did such an enlightened race disappear? Enlightened? Well, it seemed that way. And now that I am here? I wonder what it's like waking up 50,000 years later to a new galaxy. I believe this cycle cares too much about what other species think. Krogan, Turian, Solarian, all were primitives in my time. What good does their help do now? We can't win this war on our own. Then demand their help. Do not indulge their selfish requests. What will saving one Krogan matter? If only it were that simple. If they get in your way, destroy them. Excuse me? I apologize. The previous occupant of this room left traces of himself. I have absorbed some of them. Yes, Grunt. He was a strong one. Maybe it's best if I let you recover. That would be best. Did I mention Salarians used to lick their eyes? How far they have come. The Morden Salarian asked if he could dissect me. I approved, but only if he could defeat me in combat first. His reply was problematic. Then he left. I do not understand that one. This Cerberus. I do not understand why your own kind would oppose you. They will bleed the same as everyone if the Reapers are not stopped. The Rex Krogan offered me a job. He said whenever I tired of the easy life of luxury on the Normandy, he would give me something real to shoot at. Yes? Yes? Okay. Ah, uh, uh, Grunjavik. Wait, hold on. Rex, what the fuck are you doing, dude? Fucking scalping my crew? Asshat. Um, this looks about the same size as last time. I can't imagine anything so traumatic. You sure you're okay, Karen? I wouldn't wish a collector abduction on my worst enemy. But it's behind me now. I'm fine. But it makes me think of Earth and all the other Reaper-occupied worlds. What are the Reapers doing to the people who live on all those worlds? As we sit here, enjoying our coffee. How many souls are in agony this very moment? Millions? Billions? Go, oh, Greg. I lied. I'm not fine. Oh, dude, check us. Everything okay in the med bay? Yes. Morden would just like some space to work with E. He kicked you out? Oh no. <laughs> I just thought I was getting in his way. 
I'll return when I'm needed. Hello, Commander. Commander. What is a legend? Alright, so we are not needed there. Aware Krogan females find scars attractive. Garrus loyal, reasonably intelligent, bit aggressive, almost like Krogan. For the third time, Doctor, I'm not interested. Ah, Shepard, we were just. Are you okay? I'm fine, Rex. You can relax. Can't be too careful or put any faith in Solarian doctors. This one is different. Is he? What's that? Simple blood test. What kind? Kind that ends the genophage. Shepard, please. Distraction's counterproductive. Also affecting comfort of patient. He was your inside source, Rex. You can trust him. Solarians have minds like a maze. You never know when they're leading you into a trap. Trap? Eve's release my doing. Would never have known about her if not for me. I was then. But she's out now. And if she gets hurt, I'll feel it. Understand. But my patient, my responsibility, her welfare a priority. Will not allow her to be compromised by anyone. <laughs> you got a quad, Doctor. Keep her safe. Our females have endured enough. Don't forget, still need your tissue sample. I'll be back. Common phobia. Fear of needles. Or Solarian doctors. A word when you have a moment, Shepard. Oh dear, why do I feel like that's about to go tits up? No, 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 no. Entire catalyzing process would fail. Severe neurological damage. Never mind. What are you talking about? Method to extract functional cure without killing you. Many variables. Your immune system compromised. Considering options. <coughs> and you have to do it out loud? Yes. Auditory learner. Need to hear self think, simulate conversation to promote new ideas, maximize productivity. But you're talking about me dying. Oh, apologies. Medical details causing emotional distress. I hadn't considered effect on patient. No, it just means I can't sleep. Doing my best to keep you alive will avoid sensitive subjects. <laughs> Good job, dude. Thank you for saving my life, Commander. I didn't think the Krogan had any allies left in the galaxy. We owe a lot to you, even if most people have forgotten that. They can be forgiven. Our actions have hardly inspired friendship. Part of being friends is knowing each other's name. I feel bad that I don't know yours. I surrendered it the day I became a shaman of the female clan. <coughs> I belong to my sisters now. But perhaps one day, when this is over, you can know it. I didn't realize the Krogan had female shamans. Wisdom comes from pain, and the genophage has made us very wise. Rather than surrender to despair, a few of us chose to preserve the ancient ways. We safeguard our culture, our knowledge, our secrets. So when our children live again, the Krogan will flourish. How were you initiated? You're locked in a cave for seven days with just enough food to last. On the eighth, you'll starve. What does that prove? Your resolve. Every acolyte is given a chance. You either claw your way out through the rock with your bare hands, or you die. That's a brutal initiation. But an illuminating one. You learn to appreciate the light by living in the dark. What do you think of Rex? When he's not trying to sire half of Tachanka, he's the best thing that's happened to the Krogan. But I won't tell him that. His head's big enough already. <laughs> Literally. He's turned into a strong leader. I know in his heart Rex wants what's best for us. Though not all the other clans see it that way. Why would the other clans give Rex trouble? You'd think they'd want a better future. It's not in the nature of our males to cooperate. They've evolved to be selfish. Their only concern is survival. Rex is different. He's a mutant. And that, you can tell him. Do you think Rex will want revenge for the genophage? Some clans will expect it, but I hope Rex resists. 
He understands the cycle of violence must end if Krogan are ever to have a voice in galactic politics. Still, he's just one Krogan. If enough clans demand it, he may not be able to stop them. If you don't mind me asking, what's it been like living with the Genophage? I knew sisters who couldn't bear the shame of being infertile. They would wander off into the wastelands, hoping a Thresher Maw would kill them and end their torment. Did the thought ever cross your mind? Yes. After my first stillborn. What kept you from ending your own life? When my child didn't draw breath, that's when my life truly began. The genophage forces us to live on hope alone. There is nothing else. There is no reason to exist other than the hope that the next day will bring change. And if it doesn't, there is always the next. How do you think things will change after the genophage is cured? Our species will find its balance again. Females will help shape the future, like in the ancient days, before we were just pawns of power-hungry males. <laughs> Most seem hell-bent on shooting anything that looks at them wrong. What else is there for them to do? Because of the genophage, they've become wandering killers, seeking targets to justify their existence, excuses to earn them honor. How has Morden been treating you? Better than Krogan males do. He's not like a typical Salarian. No, no, no. Organ redundancy results in new period before metaphase. Can't alter that. Damage to telomeres, premature aging. He does that. But I sense pain in him, too. He told me about his work on the genophage. I should consider him an enemy. Yet I think seeing my sisters and I changed something in him. Asari Borgia offspring have an allergy to dairy and... Well, it wasn't his ear. <laughs> How'd you get involved in Malin's experiments? The other females and I volunteered. We heard Malin was trying to cure the genophage for Clan Werelock. Aren't they a rival clan? Rivalries are the invention of the males. Under their rule, Tachanka has laid in ruins for over a thousand years. It's time females took back our place in society and resurrected our future. Malin was our best hope. Would you go to Malin again? Absolutely. It only takes one candle to light a fire, and then the darkness is no more. I'm sorry none of the other females survived. I know. The youngest one, Kern, was the last to go. But she knew she would enter the void free of this curse, and then smile when she looked down upon the children of Tachanka. Her spirit will be the midwife to my firstborn. I found Malon's lab. It looked like a dungeon. His experiments were brutal. We learned that too late. He meant well, but his methods grew more barbaric as he went. We finally escaped into the rubble. Eventually, a Solarian team found us. They saved our lives. We were so sick. Thanks for talking to me. It's my pleasure, Commander. I'm glad to see humans treat their women with respect. Your people have placed a lot of responsibility on you. No more than your people have put on you. <laughs> then maybe we can show the men how it's done. <laughs> Deal. Shepard, blood work complete. Indicates significant stress on Eve's system. Currently stable, but lack of Malin's research data, problematic. There's nothing we can do about that now. No. I hate to ask this, but will it affect the cure? No, cure will remain viable, but Eve's long-term prognosis, doubtful. Do what you can for her. Of course. Have you determined why she's immune? Genophage targeted hormone production during pregnancy. Modification project used same modality. Her immunity, totally different. Targeted glands now obsolete, like human appendix. Other glands mutated to produce proper hormones, enable viable birth. Also explains her weakness. Gland substitution, imperfect. Health trouble. You think you can make this work for all, Krogan? Yes. We'll use Eve's tissue to produce mutagen, alter gland function across entire species. Must improve mutagen as well, tune hormone production, long-term illness for all Krogan otherwise. Wishing we'd save the data? Pointless to consider. Correct decision at the time. Even if it would have helped now? Recrimination's useless. Data lost. Have to deal with consequences. Would like more data, yes. Would make it easier to save Eve, but destroyed it. Tainted source, too dangerous, I thought. 
Any word on Malon himself? Maybe he could help reconstruct the data. No. Ordered teams to search for him when trying to help Eve. Nothing so far. Large galaxy. Lots of places to hide. Could already be dead for all we know. Would kill him now, if possible. Unless he could help. So the end justifies the means. Not my means. But you're using the data. Encouraging more experiments like Malin's. Encouragement irrelevant. Will always be scientists willing to perform unethical tests. Can't change that. But can help Eve. Can cure Genophage. Won't ignore data vital to her survival because of unethical origins. How's she doing? No fever currently. Heart rate elevated. Likely stress. Eating appropriately. Could use another blanket. Something soft. Prefer to let her recover fully before synthesizing cure. My medical recommendation. My people don't have time for that. Her opinion, somewhat different. You always defended your genophage work. What changed your mind? Never changed mind. Genophage proper decision at time. New circumstances necessitate course correction. Those circumstances being? Reaper invasion. Turians doomed without Krogan support. Krogan need unified threat. Outlet for aggression. Cooperative symbiosis. Nothing else? No personal stake here? Getting old, Shepard. Not many years left. But still best candidate for project. Few Solarian scientists interested in genophage. None with my expertise. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. Possibly. Stakes too high for inexperience. But not about them. My work. My job to put it right. To prove I can. Nice talking with you, Morden. Thank you, Shepard. Glad to be back. You planning to stick around when this is over? Until Reaper's dealt with, at least. Then, not sure. Have made impact on Galaxy. Genophage modification, genophage cure, work against collectors, decisions, mistakes. Might go somewhere sunny, sit on beach, look at ocean, collect seashells. You go crazy inside an hour. Might run tests on the seashells. <laughs> Dude, that's pretty cool. So I'm gonna go talk to Garrus, and then it said we've got to go talk to Glyph. Shepard. Nothing. Okay. That's all for now, Garrus. Anytime. I guess talking to Liara wouldn't be a bad idea. Mord Morden's amazing. I fucking love that dude. It will work, Rex. We just need to finish building the Crucible. Although I'd be interested to learn how you found out about it. Wasn't that hard. Lucky you keep its location more secret than the fact it exists. And I'm sure you'll do a good job of both, being so famous for your discretion. <laughs> My lips are sealed. Feel free to look around. Feel free to look around. Okay. From a, a Kali, Kaylee, 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 God damn it. Kaylee Sanders to David Anderson. You won't regret this for a while unless you, f I'm not going to read all of this, by the way. Uh, you won't find this for a while unless you find an extra net connection working on Earth. I've made it out to this weapon we're building. The device isn't halfway complete. Um, it isn't even halfway complete, and it's the most breathtakingly complicated piece of technology I've ever seen. Yet surprisingly simple, apparently, to hack it. Wish I could see this thing we're creating. It gives me hope. Take care for my sake. Wait, Jack? Uh, this means the Jack that we know, right? Uh, call between Kasumi Goto, Professor S. Cerberus Operative. Prothean notes. Yeah, I said I wasn't going to read all that. Um, it said we need to come come here. Advanced biotic implants. This advanced amp is sophisticated biofeedback system that interfaces with a set of armors microcomputers. The amp can be set to help streamline the use of biotic skills and combat powers, or increase their damage instead. <clears throat> Our cooldown is good enough, so I'm going to go for damage. Our uh, cooldown is pretty good. At your service. Especially considering we're only using one weapon. 
Uh, CIC, the captain's cabin. I know there's not really anything here yet, but we have fish, right? Um, where's the head? G give me head. There's head. <laughs> Fucking love that thing. I don't even know why. I don't even know why. Okay, um... I didn't mean to do that. Commander, nice to see you again. How are you settling in, trainer? I actually feel somewhat useful. It's been challenging to integrate data feeds for the war summit. How are the systems holding? Well, I'm glad we performed stress tests. Specialist trainer has been extremely helpful. The accuracy of our war room data is a direct result of her work. Thank you, Edie. I'm still getting used to all of this. In the lab, we'd hoard everything, piles of tech everywhere. Out here, it's like living out of a shoebox. Life on an active ship always feels crowded at first. You'll get used to it. Oh, it's not a bad thing. I've got no problems getting cozy. <laughs> this is wonderful. Back in the lab, we had to hoard because we had no budget. Now? Edie, Ariaki Tech uses a proprietary smart processing algorithm that could clean up our long-range data. Can we license it? We can. Analyzing and applying the upgrade now. The algorithm should reduce long-range strategic combat data analysis time by 3%. Impressive. If it means getting the equipment I need, I can quite happily live out of a shoebox. Commander, I've set up a secure communications with the Turian and Salarian governments and added their combat data to our boards. Hopefully it'll give us some idea of what's going on. Cool. Nice. Uh, thank you for the follow, dude. I appreciate that. Welcome to the stream. See the Turians really should get behind the alliance. They've got so much in common, like shooting things and not wanting to die. And... Now that's about it. So, bringing the Krogan to a war summit went well. You want me to invite the Batarians too, or the Vorcha? Building alliances is the only way we stand a chance against the Reapers. Yeah, but the Krogan? I'd feel better if we had a tighter plan, like time travel or teaching the Reapers to love. Still, good to have Morden back. The bad guys shouldn't get the monopoly on mad scientists. That image of him then? Holy shit, he'd the seen things. Came by. I have questions about the genophage. Yes, Shepard? Uh, she said she had questions about the genophage. Carry on, Edie. Understood. If you wish to talk more, this body will be here. I'm getting the crew used to seeing me on the bridge. Noted. Interesting. Okay. Cool. When I spoke to everyone. Right, so, um, we do kind of need to go back to the Citadel as well. Alright, what do we got? We got, uh, Extractorian survivors investigate Cerberus presence, investigate missing scouts. Um... Um, I guess the Krogan DMZ. You just realized what day today is? Well, what's the day? Is there gonna be Reapers here? Well, it seems there's no... Normal is. I found something. Oh, Jesus, all right. 
Well, there's Reapers. Is there a short way of saying it? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what today is. Should I broke a wet squad? They are. What are you doing? Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> God damn it. 100% <laughs> of assets. Everybody loves a good 69, right? Signal oh, here we go. More fuel? Yeah, more fuel. Oh, we're already percent. I could have Education budgeted that even successful. if I wanted to. We're already at 100%. Okay, let's go drop on Tuchanka. 